Hello! Today I'm going to read the rainbow fish. The rainbow fish. Ooh. A long way out in the deep blue sea, there lived a fish. Not just an ordinary fish, but the most beautiful fish in the entire ocean. His scales were every shade of blue and green and purple, with sparkling silver scales among them. Ooh, look at how shiny. <clears throat> the other fish were amazed at his beauty. They called him the Rainbow Fish. Come on, Rainbow Fish, they would call. Come and play with us. But the Rainbow Fish would just glide past. Proud and silent, letting his scales shimmer. Oh. One day, the little blue fish followed after him. Rainbow fish, he called. Wait for me. Please give me one of your shiny scales. They are so wonderful. And you have so many. You see the little fish? You want me to give you one of my special scales? Who do you think you are? cried the rainbow fish. Get away from me. Shocked, the little blue fish swam away. He was so upset, he told all of his friends what had happened. From then on, no one would have anything to do with the rainbow fish. They turned away when he swam by. So sad. There's Rainbow Fish. What good were the dazzling, shimmering scales with no one to admire them? Now he was the loneliest fish in the entire ocean. One day, he poured out his trouble to the starfish. I really am beautiful. Why doesn't anyone like me? I can't answer that for you, said the starfish. But if you go up beyond the coral reef, into the deep cave, you will find a wise octopus. Maybe she can help you. The rainbow fish found the cave. It was dark inside, and he couldn't see anything. Then suddenly, two eyes appeared. They caught him in their glare, and the octopus emerged from the darkness. <gasps> Look at that octopus. I've been waiting for you, said the octopus with a deep voice. The waves had told me your story, and this is my advice. Give a glaring scale to each of the other fish. You will no longer be the most beautiful fish in the sea, but you will discover how to be happy. I can't, the rainbow fish started to say, but the octopus had already disappeared into the dark cloud of ink. Give away my scales? My beautiful shining scales? Never. How could I ever be happy without them? Suddenly, he felt the light touch of a fin. The little blue fish was back. Rainbow fish, please don't be angry. I just want one little scale. The rainbow fish waved. Only one very, very small shimmering scale. He thought, well, maybe I wouldn't miss just one. Carefully, the rainbow fish pulled out the smallest scale and gave it to the little fish. Thank you very much, the little blue fish bubbled playfully as he tucked the shiny scale in among his blue ones. I'd rather, a rather particular feeling came over the rainbow fish. For a long time, he watched the little blue fish swim back and forth with his new scale glittering in the water. He gave his little friend a scale. A little blue fish whizzed through the ocean with his scale flashing 
So it didn't take long before the rainbow fish was surrounded by the other fish. Everyone wanted a glittering scale. The rainbow fish fought the the rainbow fish shared his scales left and right, and the more he gave away, the more delighted he became. When the water around him filled with glimmer, glimmering scales, at, he at last felt at home among the other fish. Finally, the rainbow fish had only one shining scale left, the most, his most prized possession he had been given away. Yet he was very happy. Come on, rainbow fish, they called. Come on, come play with us. Here I come, said the rainbow fish. And happy as a splash, he swam off to join his friends. The end. Look at the rainbow fish. He has one shiny scale left. See you next time.